Hi friends, wedding planner being a trending business since last few years and if you are in plan to make a website for a wedding planner firm or professional this video is for you. I am happy to record this video as I got a wonderful theme for this category. This is wedding planner responsive wordpress theme and of course this theme has been specifically made for the wedding planners so it has all the features available for this segment the theme has been developed by free vision and they are elite authors the theme was developed in 2017 only and regular updates for this theme is also being done the th this theme has got eight wonderful home pages and all the home pages have a decent and aesthetic look in itself and you can choose any as per your choice and requirement and I'll show you one or two demos and I'll also give the link of these demo in the description of this video so this is one of the demo this is the one of the demo of wedding planner wordpress theme and it has very clear and to the point look in itself and okay so it gives a very wonderful impression of images and the content and the theme has modern look as well as clean look so and this is the another layout of wedding planner wordpress theme and it is also having a very professional look in itself over effect is really amazing and it gives an impression of a professional website of course so in this video we are going to install wedding planner wordpress theme in a fresh installation of wordpress and we will also import the demo content along with the we will also watch the theme options and all the features available with the theme so let us begin the installation of wedding planner wordpress theme for this i have a fresh installation of wordpress in which i have already installed the 2021 wordpress theme that comes by default in fact and i got the theme pack as well so in the theme pack there are bundle plugins there are multiple bundle plugins available in the theme and documentation dummy data is also here licensing some phd files has been given wedding planner theme itself and the child theme so for installing the wedding planner theme please go to the theme section of wordpress click on add new upload theme choose file and here you need to choose wedding planner.zip file and if you are having direct access on your server you can upload the same file to the wp content themes folder i am doing the same it will save some time so both activities are same don't get confused either you can upload from here or directly on server and the theme size is 8.48 mb it is very lightweight theme itself so it is going to run fast with the website and it will be uploaded within seconds so once the progress bar turns green with 100 percent we can go back and extract the uploaded file and the extraction outcome is this wedding planner folder 
in which we got all the theme components folders and files now we can delete the zip one it is not required now so come again to the theme section of wordpress now we have wedding planner as another theme option let us check the details this is wedding planner version 4.2 by free vision and wedding planner is a responsive wordpress theme well suited for wedding planner websites yes activate it and upon activation we got an alert to put some purchase code and all these things so it is formality if you have already the purchase code you can enter here if not we can proceed i am not activating this thing because i am just demonstrating the thing i'll show you the theme options once we complete the installation and since the theme panel has not prompted to install necessary plugins and that we have in bundle with the theme so i will go for the uh, manual installation of plugins and these are the plugins so let us check uh, whether it works or not but i am knowing not going to hide anything so i am just uh, uploading the plugins and i am uploading the plugins uh, through the server interface and you can upload the same through wordpress panel and i am just selecting js composer and it will definitely take a bit time but for completing the process it is necessary activity and we have to do it and i am uploading all plugins one by one i have uploaded some of it okay So, for revolution sliders, next is WordPress importer itself. Okay. Okay, fine. So I have uploaded all the plugins. Now I am extracting the uploaded files one by one. And what to mark it is here now. So delete it. Mailchimp. MailChimp is here, so we can delete it now. Was the wedding planner? Revolution slider.
and the WordPress importer. Okay, wonderful. Now I have installed all the plugins along with the theme. Now we can check our website how it looks with the theme and plugins and this is the basic look of wedding planner theme and it is of course without any demo content so if we want to put the demo content uh, we can definitely uh, import the demo and you can even uh, start from here uploading your own content everything can be done from press uh, but I am going to import demo content so that is available in theme pack itself and okay so dummy data is here demo files Mission widgets are here so I'll import the demo first using WordPress import options so we have already installed the WordPress importer so I'm running the WordPress importer choose file and using the content.xml I'm putting the XML file and just assign a user download and import file attachments and click on submit it will take some time because it is going to download the media files as well in this activity so we have to be here without refreshing or leaving the screen however I I started the uh, demo upload manually but it can be done uh, in one click as well so um, once we activate all the plugins we have a uh, uh, import demo data option under appearance section so we can use this option as well uh, this options in this page first shows the core vitals of hosting and it should all green and uh, we can use the import demo data option here and I believe this is more comfortable for all of us so leave the manual import of demo as I was showing it was just uh, to let you know how the manual import can be done and I am importing uh, the demo data using this option now import demo data and I just click it so it is actually not working there has been a critical error please check your site admin I don't know what happened let me refresh this page somehow it is not working but I have also uh, uploaded the 
demo data manually so i believe there is some error uh, what is important plugin injective please deactivate the plugin okay i am so sorry so we need to deactivate this plugin and it was written in very red so it is my fault apology and now i am actually going to delete it it caused error i never hide anything in my videos so everything is on your screen and i work along with you now i am again here so the red the red warning is vanished now and now again i am clicking on import demo data and now it seems it is going and working and yes it will take time again but for a demo website we have to do this let us wait at this screen only don't leave or refresh this page and you will reach on this screen once the demo gets completed demo import gets completed all done have fun and these are um, so i since i uh, imported the media files manually as well this is why it is showing already exist but it does not matters it may not come to you uh, since you are going to i advise you have to use the import demo data option directly rather than using the uploading the files using wordpress importer so uh, import demo data uh, if you are using import demo data these files already exist will not come and if um, if somehow it gets fail you just click on the import demo data option again and uh, repeat the process until it uh, shows you all done have fun and now we have to import the sliders as well so sliders uh, all sliders are listed and i am importing the sliders and okay so any existing side i might be overwritten please select fewer items okay fine it is good and now let us check our website how it looks and what we got in the demo content okay it is still like earlier but yes some content is here so i'll check the pages what pages we got and yes there are multiple pages here and home is also here so home ultra wedding is here and all home pages are here so i believe it should work uh, i'm just checking randomly so whether all has been working or not yes it is here so okay that is good and home layouts ultra wedding okay so, yes so we have completed our activity and the original images has not been uh, provided in the demo and of course you don't need the uh, demo images because ultimately you are going to use your own images and rest of things are fine and as you can see on the screen uh, so uh, we have got a demo website as we seen in the demo and the activity is completed without any hassle or error so it is working fine and all pages are also good i believe now we can check one or two and this is one of the inner page this is about page and it is also very good no doubt so i can show you the other pages as well and this is the vendor page so everything is absolute and fine and now i 
I'll fix the home page. I mean, select the home page using the uh, WordPress interface, or we can do it from theme options as well. So, let me show you. Mm -mm. home page setting is not here so I'll use the appearance customize options home page setting is here and choose a aesthetic page and select home as home page and just click on publish your home page will be set And yes now now I'll uh, this is the website uh, I will just show you okay so this is the final resultant website and you can choose any home page all pages are here only and home page is set now and, and okay so why this is taking page id i'll show you what uh, can be the problem and if we check the direct domain name okay so it is redirecting to page id i'll fix this also is simple to handle all such things and go to the setting for my links and just select the post name and click on save changes and again click on save changes now visit the website page has been redirected programmatically so it it should not be any problem but it should not like this and it should work fine so let me check again mm -mm -mm. under customize Home page setting, aesthetic home page here, and it should be like not like this. So I am I am using ultra wedding and publish. Now let us check. So now it is fine. So we have to select ultra wedding or any sub page, and that was menu only. So it is fine now, and it is now on main domain. I mean, home page is set, and you can select any of the home page, all are available. So you can choose any, these are the pages, and you can set any page as your home page so no worries all are here and yes of course we have completed the action of uh, WordPress to wedding planner theme installation and demo import now I will take you through the theme panel and after that I will show you how to customize the text and layout uh, so let us take a quick look of theme panel mm -hmm. and this is the theme option and the theme option we have very simple feature and 
they are very less and it should be enough to handle the theme general options typography layout option is here primary menu main logo and yes you can change the logo uh, from here and footer content page post miscellaneous countdown page color options and ye yes you can handle colors socials and utility okay fine so let us check what we got additional everything is common as in wordpress and yes so nothing is additional here now i'll i'll show you how to change the text or content of any page okay so i'm going to dashboard and just open the page which you want to edit let us assume we uh, need to edit the home page just click on edit on edit with wp bakery page builder and it will take some time in loading in fact front end editor works a bit slow but once loaded it works fine so we have to wait and once it loaded you just click on pencil icon whatever you want to edit and you can simply edit the text so it is more than simple and even a non technical person can do this so nothing like this that it is going to be critical for you it is simple and just click on pencil icon and hit on save and you can use back end editor a front end editor is not comfortable for you I believe yes so okay so these portions are somehow on top of the page I got confused so contents are here okay so you can simply uh, edit the contents from using backend editor as well it is simple and you can even add or remove sections what you want to add or remove so everything is fine with this theme and we have successfully completed the installation of wedding planner wordpress theme in this video and the resulting website is also working fine and we got multiple home pages in the demo and definitely you can put your own content and uh, take your website up and if you have any question regarding this theme installation or uh, any support is required you can uh, surely write me on the comment section of this video and i am also going to give the link of my website um, in the description of this video where you can get this theme and even you can choose the hosting plans and you can get in touch with me directly i'll try to answer your queries as much as possible and thanks for watching and i assume you have subscribe this channel if not just ring the bell and subscribe the channel i'm going to bring wonderful themes plugin and utilities for you thank you